Hey guys, thanks for watching this tutorial. Again, this is Jorge Silvestrini, and we're gonna be talking today about how to input triplets and more. Uh, sometimes we do triplets, sometimes we do uh, quintuplets, sometimes we do sevens, nines. Um, it doesn't matter what we're doing. I'm gonna show you a very simple way of doing this inside of Finale. This works either for Finale 2012 or Finale 2014. The tool that we're gonna use is the tuplet tool, which is uh, this here on your main tool. It'll be the one that has the three and the eighth notes. It's also on our simple entry palette, and you'll see it here as simple tuplet, okay? So what we're gonna do is, let's say that we want to input a triplet, uh, an eighth note triplet. So I'm gonna select tuplet tool, I'm gonna select the uh, eighth note from the simple entry and we're ready to go. I can just go in here and click, let's say C, and it will already give me a triplet. Then I could do the next notes and that's as simple as that. Let's say that I want to do another triplet, but this time the first note I want it to be at rest. So I'll start a triplet, now press R it will give me a rest and then I could continue with the next notes like that. Let's say I want to fill up the bar so just do like that. So let's say I want to do now uh, some 16, some, some uh, quarter note triplet. So I'll go select quarter note and there they are. Oops, we did that one, something like that. And that's how we would do that. Okay, so triplets are as easy as that. Uh, let's clean up a little bit here. So let's go down here and now let's try something different. Let's try, so let's try five. And in order to do five, what we'll need to do is we're gonna have to press shift and then we're going to click. And as I do that, once this box comes up, we can then tell it, okay, I want to have five. Use current means use the note that I had selected. In this case, it's gonna be the eighth note. I could change that if I wanted. If you open that box, you could change it to whatever it is that you want to. But I wanted to say use five eighth notes in the space of two eighth notes. Use current. I could change that as well. Okay, I'm gonna press OK, and you're gonna see how Finale is just going to input these five notes now. There they are. And I could type them, or I could come back and put rests by selecting the note, and then just pressing R as I move around. Um, and that's as simple as that goes. Let's say that we, we want to do seven now. So we'll, again, press shift, click, do seven in the space of two, and it will do seven. We could just change them all if we wanted to. Don't want to do that. Something like that, and then I say we finish, we still have our two beats there. Um, let's say that we want to do something a little bit crazier here. Let's say that we want to do nine 16 notes. So nine 16 notes, current, in the space of four. There they are. We can just keep going. get all of those one two three four five six seven eight nine okay then finale gave me all that but just to show we still have our three beats left in there because we're on a four four measure okay so um, this is the way that you would do that this is the way that you will add triplets or other different um, tuplets that you need to. 
Um, let's do one more. Because sometimes we want to do an actual thing where it is like this. Like a two. So we could get really creative inside of Finale and do all sort of things. And then Finale also knows and it will auto populate uh, the rest for us as we need them. Okay? So hope this tutorial helps you uh, figure out how to do triplets and more. If you still have any questions, you know that you can reach me via email me at jorgesilvestrini.com. You can reach me on the social media at jsilvestrini, that's my Twitter, or Google Plus, plus Jorge Silvestrini. Know that if you comment on YouTube, um, it's the same as Google Plus, so you can find me there. Uh, we also have a community growing for Finale in Google Plus, so let me know if these tutorials are helping you and what would you like to see more okay so until we speak again have a great one talk to you soon